This one represents the CBS crew since about 98. Can't be stopped, California Bomb Squad. I had an older brother that started doing graph in the mid 80s, and all his older friends that were doing it in high school kind of gave me a, an outlook on what graffiti was all about and going out and tagging, getting the adrenaline of the art. My brother started writing graph in junior high also. And he was in a crew called VIP, which is in uh, San Diego Valley, like the mid 80s. And he wrote Rebel. <laughs> yeah, from there I used to see all their sketches and their notebooks and all their different tags. And I just thought it was the craziest thing, you know, like something aside from what I was used to seeing. Uh, I grew up in El Sereno, uh, between like uh, Lincoln Heights and South Pasadena. About 92, we had a crew called TCD, and uh, everywhere we went, uh, we were always getting lost. And I, didn't, I didn't know how to drive then, but I knew my way around the streets. So my friends were like, man, we should call you Atlas, man. You know your way around town. And we have to be crazy to do it. Like, I mean, just to be able to be an artist, I think most people are crazy because it's a uh, it's an outlet, you know what I mean? And without an outlet, you pretty much go haywire. I only represent CBS right now. There's been a few other careers I represented in the past, like Stepping Stones to where I'm at now. I still have WGS running, it's one of my old labels. Uh, so we got skills. Uh, Clear a box made up. And uh, Vox was already in CBS, and so was Epic. And so that, that was kind of like my foot in the door, so to speak. I go out with a Mitz, the Ouncer, Alloy, just the, whoever's really down to go out and paint. I mean, illegally, basically. I mean, I paint a lot of legal laws with the crew, but uh, I get more of my, I get more fun traveling out of going out behind. Check. I've been watching which way the truth. 
traffic roads You know, you know it's hard to say so What's up? Don't try Do you want a piece of your being? Grab, I don't, I don't like anything that has to do with it other than the actual act of the art, you know, like the spraying paint. Like, because the scene's whack, like, the culture's whack. To me, all that shit is whack. Like, I'm not down, I'm not feeling any of that, man. I think, like, for me, it's changed only, like, the progress and, and, uh, just playing an important role in my life since I've given, like, the best years of my, my youth to, devoted to graph, you know? <laughs> like, I have a hard time trying to deal with like our relationships or uh, trying to do my other hobbies that I try to do is like somehow like it's hard for me to compare it to graph because graph has always been there and like it's always been something that I always uh, kind, of, kind of build on you know? yeah my paintings always uh, hit up my girlfriend Maria that's my girl Los Angeles, Pomona, Los Angeles, Pomona, and uh, San Bernardino. There's a lot of train spots we we all head out to. I paint a lot of her, her, her name too. I, I painted her name a bunch of times on trains. She likes looking at. She appreciates art and everything. And she likes seeing her her name on trains. I guess you know. Like, who wouldn't? You know. <laughs> like, I think uh, Graf's definitely a, an upcoming thing. It, it's been around. You know, it's not going anywhere. More kids are more involved. The standards now are becoming uh, way higher than they used to be. Before, it didn't take much to be somebody. Now you gotta pretty much be amazing to get recognized. Especially in Los Angeles. Los Angeles, you know, there's a bunch of critics, a lot of talent, and uh, if you're not somebody that's putting it down, uh, you're pretty much not going to be uh, well represented. It's, it's hard to like make a name for yourself out here in Los Angeles. Like, you either up a lot or you just got really good skills. It's, it's sad, you know, I mean, that it has to come down to that, you know, it shouldn't even be about what uh, people think or, uh, you know, it's just all about yourself and how you carry yourself. And, your art represents yourself. The spots are getting crazier and it's taking more to do it, you know what I mean? It's no longer just one guy looking out for you. It's like you walking, talking, he's gonna, you know, tarps, harnesses, like whatever it takes to, you know, to pull it. I don't look at somebody's art and think oh like who do they got beef with or you know what I mean what their personal life is like I can care less like their work speaks speaks to me and that's it you know like that's how I, I would I would be if I went if I when I travel like I look at art and I don't think about the politics the guy in the city amongst other crews or friends or anything like that you know people that come to LA they see my stuff like that's all that matters you know like if it's just dope and it's burning that's all that, that's all it is you know